Evangelism needs to be a part of our lifestyle. And for us, it has to be about proclamation evangelism. We're there to proclaim the good news, see people come to know Christ. Jesus Christ is going to come back again and set up His kingdom. What the Holy Spirit did through my grandfather and my father. When He died and shed His blood on that cross, He shed His blood for you. I remember as a young kid, seeing the thousands not walk for it, run for it. Just to see those amazing things, they leave a, a lasting imprint. My friends, all the things that you've been longing for in life, it's found in the person of Jesus. I wanted to preach the gospel. It's because God put a burden in my heart. What's the purpose of the pen? The purpose of the pen is to write, but can only fulfill its purpose when it's in its master's hand. You'll never fulfill your purpose until you place your life in your Creator's hand. It's never been about us, the Billy Graham Evangelistic Association. It's what is the Holy Spirit leading us to do? And we work with the local churches to determine that. If you don't have prayer involved, you don't have the Holy Spirit moving, it will not work. God, we pray that minds would be open to receive, that they would hear and it would get down into their hearts. Yes. Draw them to you, Lord. We have to have volunteers to do this, otherwise it can't work. They do it because they love serving Jesus Christ, and this gives them an opportunity to serve the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. We're so grateful for what God's done in our lives, but sometimes we have a difficulty in sharing it with others. And that's when we have guys that help teach people on how to share their faith. It's a real simple process because it's tied with the celebration, then you're gonna have an opportunity to share your faith, hopefully, as a counselor, and you simply talk with them and pray with them. It's the greatest privilege to see someone come to know Christ. He carried the cross on his shoulders so you could start over. God wants to work in your life right now. My friends, he'll change everything. You'll never be disappointed. And so right now, I'm going to ask you to come and stand right down here in front of me. I'm going to ask you to do it publicly. God is calling you, and you need Him in your life right now. We work with the local churches to make sure every person that came forward is contacted by a local church. We want to make sure that when we leave the community, that we leave it in better shape than when we first arrived. You're just not affecting one person. You're seeing it for generations being affected. Those are the stories that just leave an everlasting imprint in your mind about the severity and the importance of preaching the gospel. So I'm grateful for a dad and a granddad that faithfully preached the gospel. God's called me, and Will Graham's gotta be faithfully doing this until God calls me home, and I'll be doing it until then.